InBigIsland.com presents five interesting things about the Outrigger Canoe. Unlike single-hulled canoes, the traditional Hawaiian canoe or va'a uses a floating platform called an outrigger for improved stabilization. This development permitted longer, rougher expeditions and eventually allowed ancestral Polynesians to branch out of Southeast Asia to colonize the islands of the Pacific Ocean over thousands of years. The construction of a canoe in ancient Hawaii was highly ritualistic. A person wishing to build one would first make a sacrifice of pig and fish to the deities of the forest and wait for good dreams to come. Only then could he go into the sacred uplands, select a koa tree, and make a final food offering to the pantheon of Hawaiian gods. Today, va'a are constructed from lightweight materials like fiberglass, carbon fiber, and aluminum, though they were traditionally built with koa wood, vilivili, kukui, and ulu. Cordage was made from coconut husk or hibiscus bark fibers, and the sail was made out of lauhala mat woven from dried pandanus leaves. Arguably, the most famous va'a is Hokulea, a one-to-one -one replica of the Polynesian double-hulled voyaging canoe. Hokulea's successful inaugural voyage in 1976 from Maui to Tahiti without modern navigation instruments proved the capability of ancient Polynesian sailing techniques to a global audience and helped spark the second Hawaiian Renaissance. Thousands of Hawaii residents compete every year in regattas around the state. Hundreds of crews and dozens of clubs compete in both speed and distance competitions in Hilo, with the oldest formal regatta dating back to the early 1900s. This has been 5 Interesting Things About the Outrigger Canoe, brought to you by Walters Electric Inc., where prices won't shock you.